is not within. The enemy is out there. In fact, the enemy is not even an individual. The enemy is not so much the entity, but the enemy is the spirit of deception that has taken over the MPP that wants to destroy our country. And that enemy, I don't think in the history of Ghana, that enemy has found any individual that is the worst kind of individual than Bahumia. I don't believe in the history of this country, there is a politician who is the bigger liar than Bahumia ever. Ezu, when you see me talk about Bahumia the way I do, it's not because of him. I hate deception. I hate hypocrisy. And that guy is the embodiment of the biggest deception, the biggest hypocrisy, the biggest crookedness. Ezu, that is why you see me speak the way I do. Because I see a spirit in him that is dangerous for this country. And he must be stopped by every means. Otherwise, this country is finished. Nana Kufuado may have all the problems. But trust me, if you put Nana Kufuado in Baumia, I will choose Nana Kufuado and leave Baumia. Baumia is the worst of them all. The biggest liar. That person, if you joke and you thought Nana Kufuado was bad, that one, I'm telling you, is going to be far, far worse. Because after all, Nana Kufuado may be desperate, he may be bad, but at least Nana Kufuado does not pretend. If he doesn't like you, he doesn't like you. But this one is a snake. Who smile with you, but danger. So please don't joke. Don't joke. And if you thought he was the only one, I want to tell you that even his wife is another dangerous one. So it's a couple that is full of danger and deception. So you have to do everything possible to save Ghana from the help of these two people. Not in our history should we have them. So our unity is critical the unity is not just for us to win and i believe if we work hard we win the unity is because ghana is on it is on her knees praying that NDC should make sure baumia and her wife never see the top of our, our president never it will be an abomination it will be a sacrilege it will be a curse on our country we have to do everything possible to stop that liar from rising to that place that is the presidency of God. Everything must be done to stop it. So it is no joke. Our problems are little in comparison to the biggest problem that these two will bring to our country. God hates liars. A liar is a thief. A liar is an evil person. A liar actually is a killer. And if you allow this country to be occupied by such a liar, this nation is gone for life. So please, let's do whatever we can. Let's tell ourselves our problem is not as big as the biggest threat that confronts Ghana. We, we need to win the seat. We need to make sure our numbers are massive to help John Mahama win that, that presidency.